Hey guys, what's going on? Just getting some things set up, and I'm just gonna enjoy some coffee with Autumn, because she just got back with some coffee, so that's cool. So our start time is just gonna be a little later, because we're just gonna enjoy this and chat for a few minutes. And uh, we will go from there. Oh yeah, there's the black one. Um, a veil. Okay. How about we just do... Okay, whatever. We will turn it that way. usually no. takes a few minutes. Okay. I will grab, unless you wanna. Yeah. What do you want me to get? so good. Isn't it? Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, you missed it uh, yesterday, man. I uh, had my hat off as well. <laughs> Actually, you missed two things yesterday, unless you watched the stream. Um, but the second thing is, uh, yeah, somewhere hidden in yesterday's stream. <laughs> Front and scent. That's me. But uh, yeah, the other, <laughs> the other surprise. We might as well stand up simultaneously. Okay, I'll back up and do it at the same time. Okay, ready? On three. One, two, three. Three. Da 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 da. You seeing those sweet teas, man? Oh, Aiden, what's going on? <laughs> I had a feeling you would... <laughs> oh, we're not waiting. We are not waiting tonight. Oh, we... We got coffees in hand. We got things to do. We got the sweet, tea in our hands. <laughs> yeah. Sweet teas. <laughs> well, the sweet coffees, but the sweet t-shirts. The shirts, for sure. Oh, it's what? Teas? My tits? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's probably what, totally what we were talking about. <laughs> boil your eggs yeah that's sweet of you though yeah that's hilarious <laughs> teas damn teas man yeah my teas guys oh good times i'm gonna tune in onto the t the, the disc the twitch chat oh i see here. yeah 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 thank there's you. a back to them as well sure. yeah i don't know if i'm in camera but... i'll let you know Oh man, you'll get one for sure then, dude. Okay, so, so all the handles. Yeah, so there's like Twitter, uh, Twitch, YouTube, Instagram. Um, yeah, we decided to just like finally throw a shirt together. Oh, Aiden's ahead of the game. Yeah, man, he's in on the he's in on the secrets. Um, but yeah, uh, we just got these a number of days ago, just like a few days ago or whatever. Um, yeah, really pleased with how they turn out, and they're pretty promotional for us. Like, we just wear them wherever. Public. Yeah. Grocery store, wherever. But uh, the intention is to definitely do other ones and stuff like that, so. Because I'm thinking, um, 
he wants to get the Shmup Sunday logo done, which I'm really excited about. I have one more thing to do, and then it's done, and I want to put that into a t-shirt for you. I'm really excited about yeah, that. Yeah, I'm stoked. Oh, man. <laughs> I asked Aiden if, which one he wanted. I didn't get to see what... He's going to be wanting, like, every single one we That's what I said. <laughs> I was like, with. just get, get all of them. <laughs> So yeah, how is the night going for you guys? And are you ready for some dead cells? Seriously, I've been playing all day. All day, man. And Card Dreamer, how was your dinner with the, the peeps for the going away stuff? Oh man, that's exciting stuff, man. I always love dinners with coworkers because you get to be silly like you are at work, but not have to worry about being at work. You can just focus on the conversation and the people, and you can get some really great laughs. Yeah, in. Definitely. I always love that. Yeah. Our old boss used to take us out to the keg, and everyone would get steak dinners and this and that. Yikes. DQMJ cart. No idea what that is, what game that is. But I'll take a guess. Um, Daring Quest Men Jammers. Um, I like my guess. <laughs> dumb, dumb queens must jump. <laughs> That'd be a sweet game. Oh, man. Oh. What's your plan for the stream? Well, I'm going to start off with uh, Monster Joker. Don't Monsters quit Monkey Joker. Jams. Don't quit Monkey Jams. Um, I haven't really... Like, I know what I want to do. I'm just not sure what order. So I'm thinking we'll get into the new level. Um, we'll do a run where we go through the new level and do up the boss. <coughs> and we might do that just on normal mode, just so that I can focus on making a breeze of the new enemies and mm. whatever. And after that, I will either tackle my second file with the two boss cell that I'm at, or my first file, which is at four boss cells. Um, which is like just crazy, but amazingly enough, I was doing way better in the four boss cell 11 out of 10. than the two. Holy <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> oh, that's so good. And that one must have been like 20 out of 10. <laughs> so, yeah, other than that, like, as far as I know, I'm just gonna be playing Dead Cells tonight because that's the only thing I want to be playing and uh, yeah it's gonna be good times <laughs> 111 out of 10 mm. this is so good yeah it's delicious I love just how velvety the almond milk is and oh, it's yeah. so delicious yeah. are you how how uh, long is the trip to the new place like are you gonna be able to tune in or is it like a, a 40 minute drive somewhere what's the deal man Sweet, dude. That's great. Well, as long as you guys aren't in like an insane rush, I will just like, uh, yeah, enjoy the last bit. How much do you have left? Oh, you have a lot. Okay. Yeah, but I drink quick. Yes, you do. Way faster than me. I like to enjoy my coffees differently. Yeah. Oh, man. So, Card Dreamer, you were playing Dead Cells, weren't you? Why don't you tell us all about your exciting run because I think you've made it 
it sounded like you made it further than ever before, and that's really exciting. Also, a trick for egg peeling is put it in a jar and shake it, and it'll take the shell off, or at least it'll break it up so it's easy peeling. Break you up. Break you up. Oh man, this is delicious. So yeah, yeah. how was your time with uncle? My uncle time was great. Uh, we went antique shopping. We didn't shop for anything really. We just went more like just looking at things yeah. in this uh, antique mall that is where in the city where he lives. And then got some samosas and went to his place and played this new game that is actually free for the month of May for the PS4. Whoa. Um, it's called What Remains of Edith Finch. And it's kind of like this game where you, it tells a story as you go along. You start off opening this book and there, this person in this book is, or like diary is telling you the story. And then you become part of the story. And it just takes on different like modes and it's really cool because you're finding out new things and yeah. it's about this family curse where people are dying. Man. So it's just really interesting and yeah, it, crazy stuff happens. If I get it for Switch, I will play it 100%. Nice. Because I think everyone would really enjoy the the severity of what it goes from to where it goes. Like yeah. it, it's crazy, the yeah. transitions. Crazy. But yeah, I played that and then I just got like really exhausted and he had to head out to the store before it closed, so then just came home and got coffee and here I am. But Sweet. it was a good time. Yeah, nice. That's great. And you also mentioned that you have an interest in starting to play Dead Cells. Why don't you tell the, the community about that? Well, in Discord I did mention that I was interested in playing Dead Cells and the reason I think is because a lot of the hype that's going on now yeah. with it. Um, in the Discord community and probably more elsewhere. I just don't pay attention enough to that. And then, yeah, just, I don't know. It's I'm just, just watching you play and like, you can see on screen right now, like how amazing that looks. And yeah, I'll go like that. Yeah. It's kind of like, yeah, there we go. It's so peaceful, that little boat. Oh like, man. Oh, it's just so, I, I loved the look of it from the beginning. Yep. I've complimented it from the beginning. It Definitely. was just, excuse me, more or less trying to find a reason to play it, but now everyone's kind of on yep. board, so now I'm just like, might as well try it. Yeah, it's amazing because I came away from it, the game, for a number of months. Oh, yeah, you had yeah. a long break. Yeah, I did. And uh, even when some of the initial smaller updates came in, I didn't get on board with those, but... Um, yeah, with the bigger update that just came, <clears throat> excuse me, came out, I figured, yeah, I want to check this out and get back into it. And uh, if there are other challenges to crush, then I want to crush them. But yeah, I love this title screen because we just have the boat moving. Like, it's so gorgeous. The water, the sunlight, the clouds. And you can see all of the different areas. Like, there's Stilt Village on your way to the clock tower and then you go to high peak castle and then the very top and the mist oh, that's just man. coming in yeah. front of the island it's so good and the grass just like swaying in the breeze there yeah it kind of reminds me of today our walk yeah. through the uh forest and along the whatever you call it the hydro trail yeah, yeah. the hydro trail yeah. That was really nice. Just taking a moment to like listen to the wind and the birds and that yeah. was really nice. So Card Dreamer says, beat the eye guy and died after that. Still exciting. Yeah, that's sweet man. The eye guy. Is that yeah. the You I don't I'm not sure if you've seen him because I barely go that route, but I will be going that route to get to the giant tonight. Okay. And he unlocked the fourth potion. So that's awesome. Snoopy dance. Man. so yeah all good stuff um yeah the new level looks gorgeous and the enemies are so fascinating and the boss fight itself is awesome uh so yeah i'm really eager to show you guys and i'm pretty much done so i'll just take another swallow get washed up and then we will begin 
You will begin. Mm -hmm. I'll finish your uh, logo, which will be done tonight. Cool. Um, That's great. It's actually, today is my first day of doing my very own pixel art. No, like, tutorials or anything like that. I just, like, started playing, and I'm kind of just basing some shmup spaceships off of others. But yeah, it's really cool, because, like, I'm just, ah, I'm excited. I don't usually get to do pixel art, so seeing that is, and doing it is a lot of fun. But yeah, I'm so excited. The Shmup logo is almost done. I have one more thing to do on it, and then I will probably let Dace release it, and then I will have it up on his merch shop, either tonight or tomorrow, or whenever he wants me to put it up, really. But I will get one, for sure. Because I love it. It's probably my favorite thing I've ever done in terms of uh, digital art so far for Dace. I'm not even halfway done. Oh man. I just gobble that coffee down. Oh, it's so delicious. Yeah, it is really I tasty. I can see why. Cool. All right, I will take a step <sighs> back. You Are You guys you, are ready. You take you take the show. You, you do that. Yes. Thank you. Thank Thanks you. for the coffee and the chat. Yeah, you're welcome. With everyone. I will uh chat with you guys on Twitch. See you later. Yeah, awesome. Cool. Well, I'm just going to get straightened here. What color do you want the light to be? Or do you not care? Uh, I'm not too concerned either way. Cool. Okay. Oh, man. Now we're hearing that music. Now they got the, the HPs on. All right. Um, let me just... Let's just get right into this. Okay, so yeah, maybe we'll just go like this. And you guys can let me know if the volume is requiring adjustment. Oh, okay, yeah, 15 grand, all right. So yeah, we're gonna leave it on zero cells just for now, cause uh, chances are I want to, or chances are I will be just like stopping to enjoy the sights, cause I've only been to the new level once, and so I want to be able to appreciate that and talk about it a little more without just the chaos all over the place. So anyway, um, sure, we'll go with oiled sword and this. So originally, uh, for those who missed my little explanation last time or just weren't aware in general so there used to be a giant skeleton here with like a weapon through him um so he is now gone and he's through or he was through here but we saw him vanishing into the lava and then the character is like oh i'm not going in after him so anyway, we get the key here for the cavern, because he's through that new level. So yeah, oh, this game is so good. So we'll see how it goes. Oh, dude. Ooh, sure, why not? So one thing that I've been experimenting with quite a bit lately um, is actually... Um, okay, so here's the thing. Originally, um, originally it, the game was set up in a way where if you made it to the end of the level or whatever um, in enough time, then you would access uh, like one of the timed doors in the next level. But what they did is they kind of balanced things out because essentially that set you up for 
some players who like to take out enemies and all that kind of stuff would never get it because they'd be taking all this time clearing out the level. Uh, so it pretty much encouraged people to just breeze through without exploring as much, without fighting the enemies as much, which is great because it shaves off time of, uh, for the runs. But um, what they've done is actually there's one door in between each level where if you do it within the certain time limit, you get a bonus. You can actually go into this room and get the goods. And then there's another one where it's like if you kill 30 enemies without taking a single hit, then you have access to that one. So it kind of like favors both play styles. The people who want to go super fast and ignore enemies, or the people who want to uh, explore and actually fight monsters. Um, they both have an equal chance now for getting those power-ups and stuff. So I like that. And um, because there are a lot of changes with the difficulty modes that I'm not yet used to, um, I've been doing a lot of just taking my time, whereas normally I would never take more than a minute and a half in the first level. I would literally just breeze through, ignore enemies. Um, so yeah, it's, it's really neat just being in that mode of clearing things out earlier on in the stage. So anyway, that's a, a long-winded way of explaining that, but whatever. Uh, we're just gonna keep it moving. Oh, you mother. Oh my goodness. And it's not that I ever wasn't into dealing with monsters, it's just that it was so much more valuable to me to get the timed door, so the only the only option was to just breeze through levels and not play as much game each level. But now that there's this going on, it's like, oh great, I can actually start getting used to just cleaning out right from the start of the started the run, which is a lot of fun. Yeah, that's a great way of putting it, man. Man, some of the speed runs are crazy. But yeah, honestly, um, I don't want to say that's, I don't want to say that like the breeze method is harder because it's like tricky to gauge, but like in four cell difficulty, like, it seems like an option that is no longer really feasible because there are just so many enemies and they've actually designed some of the new enemies to deal with people who just want to like skip through everything. Um, and so that's kind of like one way they sort of also encourage people to just be more thorough, or at least in my opinion. So we want to go here. Yeah, man. <laughs> I love doing this game in 30 minutes. But honestly, that's like on the easy mode. When it when it gets to the harder ones, it's all about slowing way down and just taking your time with every single enemy. Okay, I don't want any of these, so I will sell it. Maybe I'll even go like this, because I think we're seeing a lot of ceiling that we don't need to see. So I've been unlocking some of these outfits, which is sweet. Um, might as well do that while we're here. And I do want that as well, so let's start with that. Because I have no idea what that even does yet. Um, but. It'll be exciting to see. Now, I don't really need this at all because I can go through this without even... Unless I really fumble something, I almost never heal. And I don't really need that. But at the same time, I, ever since they took away some of the other 
mutations i've just found like most of these current ones are just like eh, okay whatever i'll just pick something for the sake of picking something but at least this one up is a nice cushion in case you do really mess something up oh you not want to do that. Let's get up here, man. Thanks, man. I'm stoked for when you get this game, because, like, then we can just be getting into a lot of awesome chats about dead cells. <laughs> it's, oh man, it's so good. DC tourneys with our group. Oh man, I'm so down with that. <laughs> Either that or you just, yeah, get up to snuff yourself, man. You crazy bats, you crazy bats. But honestly, it sounds to me like you've already made huge headway tonight alone. So I'm really excited just to hear more updates from your own runs, man. Uh, I didn't really need to go with that one, but whatever. Oh! Sell that. Wait. Oh, yeah, right. As if I just did that. What do you get? Ooh. Do we want this? I think we do. It's much faster. And there is no... Yeah, we're totally taking that. I cannot sell that. That's so good. I love it. Um, Gear layouts I was trying. I will post them on Twitter. Man, I would love to see those, man. Yeah, I'm so pumped to just discuss different strategies and uh, what builds are working for your playstyle and stuff like that. Uh, Dan is... Dan and Maggie, and maybe, I'm not sure if uh, their son is with them, but they said they were at Friends tonight, uh, so yeah, they're visiting, and they would be like a couple hours still or something like that. Yeah, man, if uh, Dead Cells is your way of kicking that habit, then I'm all for that. That is completely worthwhile. Let's go for this elite. <laughs> oh, yikes. Okay, so what do you get us? Two extra jumps in midair, I like that. So we will do that. Oh, yikes. 
Oh, I know. Oh man, when you're definitely ready to give it up, you'll give it up for sure. Oh, dude. Okay, let's head down into the depths here. Man, the controls and the fluidity in this game are unparalleled. So we're... Oh, yeah. I think I already missed my opportunity <laughs> to go uh, to, on, on my way to the giant. I was so preoccupied and so in the habit of just going to promenade that I... Uh, yeah. Okay, well, whatever. We'll just turn this into... A whatever run unless you guys want me to just start over because we're only eight minutes in so it wouldn't be that big of a deal but yeah Just missed it. Okay, whatever. It's not a big deal. Okay, so what do we want? Sure. Honestly, it does not matter. Man, that is so much smoking. want to get a little more comf. Those guys are vicious. Face, man. Another elite. Oh, dude. As much as I love the two scrolls, actually, yeah, and we're gonna take that for sure. 
I don't actually need the extra jumps when I'm playing on this difficulty. Because it's just not... It's not a big enough deal. I love how fast you move when you have your uh, speed boost. Oh, you got to be joking me, man. Sure, why not? Whoa, okay, you're there. Oh, dude, no way. I think in, in between levels or something, I'll just take a quick minute to look at those. Um, yeah, I'm so pumped. <clears throat> that you're, uh, yeah, seeing progress, man. So what is it you think um, is the deal with the ice now? Uh, you said you were thinking it's just not the thing to go with these days? Are you just finding it's not as effective or you could be doing something more instead of taking up a precious slot? <laughs> oh, good times. Okay, we were up there already. All right, so we head this way. Okay, one second, I will just read. And how is it you took so little damage from that guy that have nearly killed me? Uh, which one exactly? Frozen doesn't do damage in and of itself, so I only keep ice if it has a secondary damage like poison or burn. Yeah, honestly, um, it's funny because before the update, a staple of my build was the ice grenade. Um, but with just how insane things are now in this game compared to even the hardest difficulty way back, um, like I, like I just want no, more damage essentially over ice because it's just yeah, freezing enemies is great and stuff, but taking them out that much faster is just way more effective. And it is so, oh, yeah, it is just nuts. It is uh, absolutely nuts these days. The elite ninja looking guy with the big sword. Um, I'm not sure, like, uh, like I have negative 5% damage received, so that's not really doing too much. Um, Yeah, like, I don't really have anything in the works other than the fact that I've got a lot of scroll action happening right now. Um.
that's definitely part of it for sure. Um, I do keep my distance. Not as much. Like, I play in a fairly carefree way when I'm on um, the easy mode because I can literally afford to just not care um, because I know I'm just going to survive. But actually, I want that. Um, and then we'll go like that. But uh, yeah, when it comes to the other modes, I'm so, so cautious. Because it is just, yeah, it is insane. I could say that all night and oh, that will not even get the point across. But I'm determined to conquer four cell and get the fifth cell mode activated now that that's finally available to us. Yeah, honestly, I would want to be watching when that happens, just in case I can uh, figure out what might have been happening. And I actually, I did have the um, the blood droplet thing, uh, and that was like another negative 4% damage, I think. So I had a little more damage reduction than I thought, but... friend. Okay, so there's the black bridge already, but we haven't finished cleaning up in here, so... I love, I love, I love exploring this level. It's so much fun. wasn't referring to you if that's what you're res if that's why you're responding like that <laughs> I was referring to one of the enemies Ooh, another scroll 2 broadsword I like the broadsword but I almost never use it because it's just a little too slow but 
it does insane damage especially if you are doing like a straight brutality run that thing just gets stacked i like the the wolf traps that you have though those come in really handy but i don't often do tactics um interesting that you have three tactics related uh weapons or skills um but you you seem like your your brutality at, brutality is at nine so i'm thinking and you probably already know this but like if you early on in the level see that you have like something you really like then just start stacking that for sure because yeah the wolf traps and other stuff is going to be sweet um of course the legendary will be for whatever highest level applies so that's technically yeah even if you were doing tactics your broadsword legendary one uh would be yeah stacked as well even though it's like a brutality weapon so that's really cool man um and number two the ice bow man two ice grenades yeah i like doing double grenades but i that's a lot of ice did you find that was uh working out for you having the two grenades and the ice bow i think i st i for the most part i st stay away from uh like i'll take ice over fire grenade typically um but if i have like the large grenade i will totally take that or powerful grenade it's called i think because that one does insane damage too yeah man no that's sweet it's great to experiment um because yeah like the run i was telling you about earlier where i was doing so well in four cell i was using um something i have liked and used a lot of in the past but something i kind of like came away from so um i got into using that again which was cool it's like a toxic arrow bow and arrow uh, or crossbow i mean um and there was something else but it was yeah it was a really fun run that i had on the go yeah, honestly, none of these really matter to me. So... Hmm. Okay, we'll just pick that for the sake of picking it. And we're not going to use that fountain... Yeah, and, it, and that's where, yeah, just playing more and unlocking more uh, will come into play. Come on, man. What's up? Welcome. So, once again, I set out to go to the new level and do the giant, and I just completely blank on taking the route needed to get there because I'm just so immersed in blasting my way <laughs> through. So, yeah, if we're not seeing the giant this run, but maybe the next one I do. <laughs> Thankfully, this will only be about 30 or 34 minutes total. So it's, yeah, I'll easily do another one and then go to the giant for sure. You guys remind me to go to the toxic sewers, though. That's all maxed out. Oh, no, I don't want to do... Actually, no, that's all right. So 
So do we want to do Slumbering Sanch or Stiltville? What are we voting? Oh man, the colors in this game. Like, look at that health fountain. Oh, I love it. It looks so gorgeous. Hmm. Slumber. Okay. I've barely gone to slumber since I have been playing Dead Cells um, compared to the other route, but there's something really fantastic about this level, and I want to start doing more of it because it is so cool. I like how each level has its own little something that's going on. And in this one, it's you-know-what. I do want to get another bow, though, because this one isn't really what I'm talking about. As cool as it is... Oh yeah, jump straight down, man. How was uh, the time at the Friends, Dan? Okay, that's great. All right. The thing I like about this level is, or one of the things is just how we start off in this area with leaves and things like that. Oh, dude. Come here. But we soon go to this area where you're out in the open air, and it's just... You can feel the freshness. It's so cool. Oh man, when this guy activates, holy smokes. Going up going up against the elites of that type is yeah, wild. Okay, we got an elite up here. Let's see who it is. Yeah, sure. Oh. brutality more. <clears throat> oh yeah, sweet. Pot luck. Oh yeah. Okay, now we just want to make sure we don't get hit once until I take out the next few guys. So I'm just going to play it a little on the safe side. Oh, dude. It's easy to be overconfident and then fumble. I've done that countless times while under curse. And it's so avoidable. Okay, so he is dead. What do you got? Oh, that is what we are talking about. I'm thinking we're going to go like this. I like those two scrolls, but this is fire. Whatever. We're going to go like that. Selling it. Okay. I, I'm i not sure if he has seen the surprise. Oh, yikes. Okay. 
we're gonna go deal with enemies before we go through trap areas. That is for sure. Okay, so we're not doing that. Three more, three more, okay. There's gotta be three guys up here. Did we clean everything out? I think we might have actually cleaned everything up. Yikes. So there's only one place to go and that's risky. Oh yeah, we're going down here. Oh, e e yikes. Okay, even if I do, fu oh, what? Okay, even if I do fumble the curse. It's not a big deal because... Because <clears throat> it just means we can start over and actually go to the new level. Oh, yikes. We're shielded. What is that all about, man? Okay, two more. One more. Who do we want to get rid of? Okay, their curse lifted. Sweet. Okay, let's get our bearings. Uh, now that the gates are open... Hmm, okay. Actually, I think we'll just go up this way. I could just stand up and show him too. Did you like, uh, Autumn? Did you walk behind him or, or uh, in behind me or something so that he could see? Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Man, look at that guy just hulking around. doing something. <laughs> well, I'll stand up for a minute. Um, oh, I just want to stretch. Oh, oh man. Oh, just stretch. Oh, oh. It's like a five, five hour stretch session. Dan just happens to be away again. <laughs> Doesn't end up seeing it at all. Okay, what's over here? Ooh, okay, this is fine with me. Whoa! Right down into the spikes. <laughs> oh, that's great. Okay, I'm actually thinking we will take that. Sell that guy off. Yeah, thanks, man. They uh, We finally decided to get around to doing shirts, and we're very pleased with how the first run went. Man. 
Forgotten Sepulchre. This is a sweet level. Oh man, seriously, the background in this, and this is the section, or that was the section that I mentioned where you leave the cavern area and you're just in this open, fresh air. Oh, it's just so cool. Okay, so we want that. We'll just dump them in there. Where's this guy even going? Ooh. That's actually... Hmm. It doesn't really matter to me, but... Yeah, now nah, I'm not gonna take that. I'll take the cash, though. Man, that would be super awesome. I love this guy's setup. He's got like these nice little Christmas lights strung around his makeshift shop. It's literally just like big poles holding up blankets and mats or just bits of fabric. Oh, and the music that plays there is so good. Alright, let's head this way. getting dark so guess what let's uh let's find there we go okay here we go oh dude okay so let's go up this passage see what we got That's one way of putting it, man. All right. We got the crypt key. So who's liking this level? No oh, wait, we can just go like this. So much faster. Nope, not there. Sure, I'll grab that food. Oh, yeah, thank you. <laughs> oh, it's good times. Oh, man, I think it gave everyone probs the first time. I know GT Dominator and I pretty much had the same experience. 
Um, I don't want to spoil anything for Dan in case he cares. Uh, so I won't like say, but something obviously started to happen and suddenly it's just like, whoa, what? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. what's going on? Challenge Rift. Here we go. Alright, let's head in here and get some goodies. Okay, what do we got? Negative 10. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't really matter to me. If they had some extra jumps, I might, but they both got the same stuff going on pretty much, so. Oh, I fumbled that. Oh, yikes. Yikes. Oh, dude, go. Oh, yikes. Roll through the door, please, man. Great, there we go. It, yeah, you do, you do rack up the cells. This is nothing compared to uh, the other modes, though, because the higher you go in difficulty, the more cells you get from each enemy. So I'm actually getting the minimum you can possibly get right now. Since I'm just on... Uh, the normal mood. It's a nice incentive that they built where you get like three times the cells if you play a harder mode because with the amount of unlocks and stuff in this game. Oh yeah, let's do this additional fight. <laughs> oh, good times. That was some fight. Uh, yeah, we'll just go back. I think... Oh, no. We gotta go this way. Okay, let's go like this. Okay, now we can go back. And we're heading to the clock room for another fight. Yeah, I really like Slumbering Sanctuary and Forgotten Sepulcher because I'm so, so used to doing the Stilt Village Clock Tower route that it's really refreshing doing something else for a change. Oh, I'm I'm well aware of that, but at this point, like, I uh, 
there's no reason not to sell, uh, spend them because I have pretty much everything I want. So it's just a matter of sp dumping it into um, some of the new stuff that has popped up with the update. But yeah, I'm well aware. But thank you for mentioning that. On to the last level, you guys. Okay, cool. Which is mainly the outfits and some of the new mutations. Um... Hey, Kiwi, what's going on? Thanks for swinging by. We're just about wrapping up the uh, yeah, run here, and then I'll probably do another one right after. Hit up another route. First elite. Done. Yeah, no worries, dude. Okay, that's a dead end. It's a weird art style. Interesting. What uh, are you finding strange about it? with you. So we're going to get rid of that. Hmm, let's go to 
this way. This is the uh, toxic crossbow I was uh, mentioning er earlier, Card Dreamer. The alchemic carbine. It's really, really, really useful in four cell because you can just blast a cluster of guys and then just be on the run while they start taking poison damage. And when it's like S rank, it is really, really effective. Got at the shop, my friend. Nothing. A great big room for a great big painting. The seal of the king is recognizable at the center, as for the rest. So, interestingly enough, this painting is actually of the giant. He used to be um, the king's. Uh, guard or something like that. Oh, you got a scroll for me? Yeah. There we go. Okay, so we are back there, so we're just looking for the last... Okay, so maybe we'll check down this route first. We're looking for one more room. Not that we have to, um, because we have two keys and that's all, all we need to get to the throne room, but by getting the third one, that just means we get more goodies, so... Okay, what is this? Uh, nah, that's alright. So this is the one we want. <clears throat> yeah, man, your, your run the other night was sweet. I was really enjoying that. Too. All the fruits. And here's our friend. I love the background here. It's so good. And he's done. Oh. off to the final Bosch. It's just a matter of finding the throne room itself. So that. Okay, get up. Oh, actually, okay. Interesting. There's gotta be a way. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's what I thought. I was like, how did I not get that? Let's actually take care of these guys.
actually okay so yeah it's totally further down the way we just came we just didn't go far enough well, we'll just see what this is yeah you can uh, they have a nice variety uh, where is it um, diet so you have vegetarian Castlevaniesque, carnivore obviously I'm using fruitarian monster and baguette it's neat that they included so many options just for your your healing items or your food rather Ooh, look at this yeah it's funny the fact that we've been using this oiled sword from the very start of the run and I haven't come across anything else that I wanted but the fact that this look at the comparison we're going up 6,000 and we're getting two more brutality so boom that is that and what about this we get another scroll with this um yeah I'm thinking that is totally what we're talking about there's a passage there but we don't care that's actually not where we wanted to go, so... Okay, it's down that way. And to the left. Oh, yeah, to be honest, um, I didn't even think of that, but mainly because, like, when I see a weapon, like, oiled sword or whatever it is, um, I don't really plan on having it for the whole run. I think to myself, okay, like, I, this weapon is, like, whatever, so I'm just gonna get it something else a ASAP. Um, so yeah, that's kind of, <laughs> yeah. I, I don't really prioritize the starting weapons as anything to build around unless it's like one of my faves or something that seems really sweet but that one in particular is just kind of like eh. uh let's go ah eh, yeah temporal just dump them in there might as well keep unlocking there are actually a lot of outfits oh man 26 brutality we'll see what that we'll see what that does for us I know that's more than enough this is actually zero cell because my intention was to um, showcase the new level and the new boss while taking the time to like appreciate what those look like especially the level and stuff but um, so I want a more just like a, a breeze of a run. So uh, the next run will either be where we actually go to that stuff, or I will boot up four cell and just show you guys how crazy the first level is there, or whatever we want to do, to be honest. So let's just get right into this guy. I'm not sure if Kiwi is still here. 
Yeah, I'm definitely going to toxic sewers then. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. But yeah, I am stoked to um, get that fifth cell because then I can finally go into here. But until then... <clears throat> Definitely a fun run though, I enjoyed that. I'm gonna take some water swagage. Okay, <clears throat> we'll skip the credits, because, yeah, whatever. Okay, Toxic Sewers, and... Yeah, um, that was not available until the update. Um, like, it's been out for a while for uh, people playing it on other things, but not console, as far as I know. Da -da 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 -da. Boom! Look at all that stuff that happens. Oh, that's so cool. So yeah, I am finally glad. We're going to leave it at this for the uh, showcasing. But um, I'm really stoked that we finally have access to the fifth boss cell now. <laughs> I like this guy with the giant scissors. So in my other file, I actually have more outfits unlocked. Um, but... I got this one today. This one cost 500 cells. Isn't that not crazy? But to be honest, I love the classic, the original outfit the most so far. So anyway, let's just go into here again. I am going to Toxic Sewers. I'm not going to forget. We got the Cavern Key. Yeah, um, with the update, they have included outfits, so when you beat, like, bosses and stuff like that, they will reveal, or they'll give you uh, different outfits. Like the concierge, for instance, he has numerous types that you can get, um, which is cool. And uh, you can just get ones from other enemies and uh, stuff like that. Uh, we don't need anything here. You did not just do that. Oh, he's playing Dead Cells! Dan's playing, guys! Oh, I'm so happy. Which, which outfit do you have? Uh, I'm curious. Oh man, yeah, please do. It's, uh... Yeah, no, it's totally fine with me. <laughs> I'm like stoked that you're booting it up. Toxic sewer, toxic sewer. Okay, so we're not going there this time. As much as my habit would have me doing. Classic concierge. Hmm, actually, I will take that just for kicks. Oh yeah, it cannot be sold. All right, uh, let's head over uh, here. Nope. 
Don't want that. I'll grab this for now, but because I'm not doing a tactics run, it'll be... Probably something I get rid of pretty quick. What do we got? What do we got? Hmm. Yes. Just for the scrolls. Toxic sewers. So how's everyone feeling? Are we enjoying the show? Totally take that. Another too brutal. What is it uh, specifically, just hearing? Oh, by the way, ignore that achievement. I've been here tons of times. I'm not sure why it uh, is triggering that. Um, is it just the the noise that I make when I'm playing? Like all that... Because <laughs> I love hearing that too. Okay, yeah, we're totally doing this. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, you've got to be joking me. I love this, oh, the song that plays in here. Hey Fizz, what's going on? Thanks for swinging by. You just missed an epic conclusion to my first run of the night. your day going, Fizz? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Gives him the finger. Obscure game. Interesting. What, uh, what game? Selling it. Oh, right down into the acid. <laughs> right, 
want to go to the shop up here. See what? Oh, it's not a shop. It's just this. So that is not nearly as nice. That's cool, but I like the alchemic carbine, to be honest. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Chest time. And getting a little more comfortable. Okay, so we don't want to go to Ramparts, we want to go to Ancient Sewers, um, which means exploring a little more, because we've clearly missed it. Pallet. The girl who woke up with amnesia in a room with a dead body. Her memory of piecing things. Interesting. That's actually really cool. I like when games flip from one thing to another. Yep, take it. Dude. Ancient Sioux. Here we go, guys. I just want to clean up a little more in case there's anything else. Whatever, we'll just keep it moving. <laughs> 95? Man, that's crazy. Perfect amount. Sweet. All right, so. I think we'll just do that for now. I'll actually use the health fountain. We, I think we're good to go. I just want to make sure I don't mess up the route. scroll second scroll that's fine with me
want that weapon. I do want to fight whoever's in here. Goodbye. Alright, that's cool. Extra jump. Sweet. Oh, yikes. Climb up. Uh, there's a shop, so I might as well go back and down first. See what's up. Rolls this has because that would give us a nice HP boost, but hmm, that's yeah. Do I want to spend that much? Nah, I don't think I do. Actually, we want to grab this key uh, down here. All right, where are we? going. We're going to go this way. Okay, dead end. So we can still go straight down to the right or we can go up there. Okay, well in that case... Oh, yikes. We'll just do that. Almost done. down here. Nothing we want. You gotta be so close. Another scroll. Sweet. Yeah, I... Sometimes just skip them because, uh, yeah, some of them aren't too relevant. Ooh, what do we want to go with? I think cells, if anything. Just for more of those unlocks. Insufferable crypt. This will be fun. either going to do dead inside or maybe maybe that tainted flask actually no we're totally going to do that 
Let's top up that a touch. I love the colors of this boss. Aw, oh, dude. Dude, come on. was really close. Cool, he's done. Another outfit. Classic conjunctive bite. Conjunctive, conjunctivious outfit. That name always trips me up. Oh yeah, we can get that guy. Cool. All right. Graveyard. Who's ready for the graveyard? Yeah, it really is a sweet boss. It's a lot of fun. Um, he has other stages, from what I recall. I'm not sure if they like modified that with the update or if it's just he does more when you get into the harder difficulties but there's like this attack where he's at the top just like moving back and forth and shooting out all these things see I think this is a no-brainer <laughs> five grand yeah we're taking that five grand worth of damage five thousand yeah sweet The graveyard is actually a level that I have been to maybe easily less than 10 times in the whatever it's been, like 210 hours or whatever that I've played this game, which is amazing. Ooh. Okay. I kind of really like this because as much as the cluster grenade isn't as dope as it used to be, I'll take that over the uh, the infantry for sure. Okay, there we go. 
much longer load time, but... That's alright. So we got the graveyard key, and we're on our way out. Oh man, what are you missing? Everything? Yeah, it's Dead Cells Night. Nothing but eight straight hours, man. You better be awake for all of it, Card Dreamer. take every cursed chest I come across, but hmm. There are some bosses that I'm not, I mean, uh, enemies. Let's just get our bearings here. How many guys do we got? Yeah. For the sake of not fumbling and then just starting over, because I actually do want to show you guys, and the first run we didn't show that stuff, I'm just going to skip this one. As much as I would love the boost. Gonna play it safe this time around. But I do love cursed chests. It's such a blast. And once you're experienced enough with just yeah, being like under cursed, let's say five times in a run or whatever, then it's not much of a stretch to consider uh, the cursed sword runs where you do that weapon from the very start. That That's essentially a sword where it does insane, insane damage, but you cannot take a hit the entire game. Um, and that is a blast. So we don't want to go there this time. We want to keep exploring. Oh, we want to get a scroll. Apparently this, uh, what's going on here? Did, did that uh, cut out for anyone? Or was it just my browser? Okay. Well, it's, it seems to be back now. Okay, cool. 
I'm glad it wasn't for like a while because yeah. Mm, Twenty nine. Nothing, dude. Okay, so let's just go exploring a little bit. There's no way you survived that, man. So we will just keep it moving. Oh man, I love this room. The lighting is so good in here. Oh, so good. Guess what, you guys? Here's where we use the key. Are you guys ready for this? We're going to the new level at long last. But, uh, yeah, exactly. Like, already this is hinting at what the level's gonna look like. Snow and crystals. So cool. I love it. Look at that minecart with the giant crystals in there. Holy smokes. Such a gorgeous, gorgeous level that we are about to head into. Oh man, this level. Like, just look at the pink and purple colors they used. Oh, I love it. So right off the bat, those guys are new enemies. So, so gorgeous. And we have platforms that are like half the size or like the elevator. So that's new and exciting. Dude. Here we go. Doesn't matter which. It really does look gorgeous. Oh, hello there, buddy. What do you got in store today? Oh, okay, thanks. And, oh man, that's another new enemy that I saw for the first time the other day. He's just this huge dude that just hulks around. Okay, enough of him anyway. Oh, yikes. Okay, so... You don't dive into the love. The love...
cool. So where are we going? Alright, we'll head over this way. Oh yeah, he does that attack too. Interesting, okay. It's my first time fighting an elite of this type. Okay, what do we got? Three tactic scrolls attached to that. That is amazing. That just boosted our health quite a bit. Might as well just grab that because we're right here. Alright, yeah, that's nuts. Okay, so we'll head over to that section. Okay, we want to be heading up that way as far as I know. Actually, no, we'll scope this first. Sweet. I love seeing in the background through that window area and just how massive those gems are. So good. Okay, cool. So anyway, moving right along, we're going to go up uh, this way. Just keep on moving upwards. I don't think there's actually... Oh yeah, the birds! I love these guys. They're so cool. As if. Okay, come on down here, man. Seriously? There we go. Finally cooperates. That was silly. Oh, as if I just did that again. Interesting. What is that? What on earth? I have no idea what that was. Ooh, 
that sweet, but I'm going brutality, so whatever. I wouldn't be too concerned about the, the missed secrets. Most of the time, it's just like 800. And to be honest, I'm not exactly spending much. Like in my last run, I totally forgot to even spend to make my weapons as strong as they could be before the end fight, but it wasn't really necessary anyway. Holy smokes, man, you just keep doing that? Okay, so that just seems to be a trap of some sort, perhaps? through this, though. Yikes, okay. Let's just avoid the birds a little bit. So not into the Spartan sandals. Guardian's Haven, here we go. Time to face the giant. The giant creature. Car Dreamer, are you still with us? The sound effects in this game are so good. Okay. Let's check it out. Look at the size of this guy. <laughs> I love it. It's so good. First phase done. Yikes. I am still learning the the patterns, to be honest. So bear with me, guys. Okay.
At least we're dodging that. That's cool. soon. No worries, man. Uh, you, yeah, tend to whatever you gotta do, man. Thanks for swinging by anyway. Have a good one. Giant killer. Hmm, we don't want this, so we'll just sell it. It, to be honest, it's not a challenging fight on this difficulty. We'll see how it goes when I uh, make it here on four cell, though. Actually, the only way to get the fifth cell is to beat this boss on four cell. Whereas all the other cells, you just beat the final boss of the run. Anyway, it's off to High Peak Castle again. Yeah, it's a sweet story, dude. And it's a really cool boss. I'm so, so glad they did <clears throat> a new area. And I'm stoked for when they add more stuff. Giant Killer. So I got no cells to pump into that, but... That's all right. Another secret, but oh, yikes. Okay. Good night, Fizz. Thanks so much for swinging by. I definitely appreciate it. And I trust you enjoyed a bit of the show while you were here. I'll see you next time. I think this time I won't take as much time to like clean up the enemies. Because we literally just did all this. I will just get a move on with uh, the run, just by blitzing my way through everything. Have a good one, Iodin. Thanks for swinging by as well. And we'll talk tomorrow, dude.
secret passages everywhere. Yeah, no worries. seen that happen before and he seemed like a normal guy so I have no clue what that was all about that's really strange okay we're gonna go up for that scroll first. Okay, so nothing there that we care about. You did not even do that to me, man. I would love to have the Assassin's Dagger right now. There's a challenge rift there, but I don't really care to bother with that extra stuff right now. Did we already do this? Yeah, we totally already did this one. So it's just a matter of... Heading somewhere else, like... Uh, yeah, we'll go here. Actually kind of tap. As much as during this run, I love the infantry bow. Close range crits are so easy to pull off. And when your brutality is stacked, it does huge damage to the face. I love it. So how's Autumn enjoying the show? I realize you're focused on the, uh, the creativity. animal hmm are you finding any any info as to why that might be the case because that is strange stuff At least die, man. Um, let's just scope that so we have a quick way. So I just want to 
take a quick look. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, those three tactics scrolls are crazy right now. Because we're at 28,000 health. And we are heading to the end boss now. Seriously, having this stacked is just nuts. Okay, we're gonna go this way, because I think this is where the throne room is. Yep. So we'll just grab our last minute goods. Ooh, there's a cursed sword. But... Inflicts a critical hit if the victim is an elite enemy or a boss. That's sweet. I do really want to see what that's like, so I'm going to dump, pay half that off now. Because why not? Okay, this time I'm going to remember to boost everything even more. Because we are jacked with the gold right now. Oh, I'm using the frantic sword. Interesting. So we'll upgrade that. And actually, that's the only thing that we can upgrade. Cool. Thirty-one thousand six hundred seventy-one health. Jeez, that is sweet. Yeah, I love this game. Oh man, oh man. So good. First phase done. <laughs> so good. down there and that's useful. As if I just threw the cluster grenade down the opposite side now. That's is hilarious. As if. matters because he's dead anyway but sweet cool so now we're gonna boot up for cell and see how that goes Although I think if I, or, oh yeah, if I switch cells, so that'll, okay, so first I'm going to go to the end of this level just so I can spend the 40 cells and make use of them, because if I switch difficulty modes now, I will lose those. 
So we're just going to quickly race through and put those to use and then we'll start over. But this is going to be so quick. done 48 seconds to go through that might as well get more cells too in here that's sweet giant killer is unlocked Sweet, that is that. So let's see what this... Oh, that weapon is wicked! Or at least the movement of it. Oh, that is so cool. I love the animation. It's so cool. Alright, anyway. um, Yeah, so we can just... Quit... That's what I'm thinking too. I'm not sure how feasible it will be for runs, but because uh, it's only ever gonna crit crazy. I'll see, okay. Oh, I didn't even switch the uh, thing. Oh, why am I not able to? the difficulty mode maybe because I broke the door and started the run already probably yeah there we go okay so let's put those up um, yeah because like you're never gonna crit an enemy except for the elites or the bosses which are few compared to um, yeah everything else but okay I don't like those weapons so we'll just restart but it would be neat to see just how it works. I know right off the bat it's not looking as fast as other things, but I don't mind checking that out. Okay, I'm just gonna do a few restarts until I find something that is a little more to my liking. But it probably won't take too long. Hmm. I'll take Frantic Sword and that for sure. everyone teleports after you in this uh, difficulty. Just about, anyway. Okay. Oh, 
Dude, you gotta be joking me, man. Not super crazy about the boomerang, but <laughs> whatever. Jeez. Oh, as if I just rolled right into where the bomb was gonna be. Insane. Okay, let's get Assassin's Dagger and Infantry Bow. Let's go. Oh yeah, I want to see what the mirror does now that I've unlocked that. There's something fishy about this beast. Interesting, okay. So maybe I go after him with the Hunter's Grenade. Oh, amazing. Assassin's Dagger with a Brutality. And we've got S ranked with two scrolls for the Ice Shards. That is doable. Whoa, what a start. stoked for if and when you do though <laughs> I realize you're not thinking you will but if you ever get that into it and you just want to progress that far oh man I'm fully in support of that really could just be taking it slower and having an easier time and yeah doing a better job at conserving my health but yikes bombs bombs and I'm Dead again, you gotta be joking me. Jump right into it. Oh, I'll take that stuff. See what it can do. So far, I'm liking this. Oh! And I'm out again from the bombs. You gotta be joking. Three bomb deaths in a row? That is a joke. I was really loving the broadsword and the ice bow combo, though. That is sweet. Normally, I would not really play something that slow, but... Okay, what do we got this time? Hayabusa Boots, S-Rank, and Pyrotechnics. Man, I remember the first time I got Pyrotechnics in the game, and I felt all-powerful because it was like, what? You can just, like, launch all these fireballs like crazy. There's no limit to it. Whoa. And I remember GT Dominator having the same experience as well. Just be like, what? It's, like, the craziest thing. It's so powerful. Okay, so I'm liking this combo. Quite a bit. Oh, okay, you're there. The 
pyrotechnics? Is that what you need? I'm assuming that's, yeah, what you're talking about. Yeah, it's interesting because the time that I first got it, it was like a... It just happened to be a legendary drop from uh, one of the bosses. I'm not sure which one. It might have been the concierge at one point or something. Oh, dude. You gotta be joking me. So it was like, it was even more powerful than normal because of the legendary status. And that's probably part of why I was like, what? Whoa, the best thing ever. Whoa, bombs again. Not taking that, dude. Okay, there's an elite up here. And it's about to get really, really crazy. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Jeez Louise, man. Oh. Just fire and brimstone everywhere. I rolled a fraction of a second too late. Man. To think prisoners' quarters can be this insane. It's hilarious. But to be honest, I'm not actually taking my time. I'm kind of just like... Ooh, of course we're going to do Cursed Sword and see how long we even last in this insanity. One hit and we're done. My goodness. I was, I had a really awesome run today where I was actually taking my time. Um, uh, I made it farther than I have since the update on this four cell mode. So that was like really sweet. And it just showed me that like, yeah, it's all about the approach. Okay, we'll see if we survive this. Oh man, he's got that. Oh. <laughs> when he has the uh, line of energy that circles him. Oh man, that's hilarious. I think some people do um, five cell curse sword, if I didn't mention this already. That's crazy. Cool. Well, I'm liking this already. Man, what's with all these elites of this type? Oh, dude, man, you are... Oh, yikes. We got this guy, though. Oh, not if I take... Oh, man, I was cl getting close, though. Oh, bombs, man. Bombs. Oh, dead again. I really must slow down and just do this systematically. That's pretty much the only way. Because my blitz mode is just not doing it these days. Ooh, giant killer, S rank, ice bow, S rank. Oh. Watch like 60 seconds from now, I'll be. <laughs> Toast again. Okay, 
you those guys are so pesky with their little poison darts and they're hopping around everywhere jeez oh sweet giant gr or a powerful grenade v uh, 5 plus plus oh yeah this is starting to look like a wicked run how are your runs going dan I'm just gonna take my time. Oh yeah, right, dude. Well, he's dead, so that's sweet. Extra jump, two scrolls. Yeah, awesome. Sweet, what are you, uh, anything in particular? Like, noteworthy? Man, the giant killer is sweet. It might be, like, a part of it is the fact that I have five brutality already, but the fact that it's 2,600 damage. That is working for me, that's for sure. actually going really well considering even though I've taken lost half my life this is really sweet oh, man this weapon is awesome all right where can we go next Ooh, tactics build. Nice. Throwing knife, multiple Nox bow. Double cross B. Oh, This run is going so, like I'm just amazed. Okay, we don't want that. You are pesky, man. sweet or maybe even that i think i'll go fire this time though since that's what's here oh okay See you later. Okay, we're gonna keep the pendant we have. Man, the 
this weapon is sweet. Okay, is there anything else we can explore? I think that's it. Yeah, cool. Totally go with Igdar Oris Leox for sure. That's what will be that. Yeah, honestly, Dan, there are some seriously amazing synergies in this game in terms of like builds and comboing and stuff like that. I did not need to just stand and take that grenade bat. You gotta be joking me. Yikes. So I really want to find some... some health. As much as I could use a potion, I really don't want to. Because of this. Oh, yikes, that was so close, dude. Normally, there's help soon enough, but uh, let's see how soon. Thankfully, we can just take our time. There be f wait okay so there's a challenge rift there's no way i'm going in there until i heal up though all right yeah i'm totally okay i'm not even gonna bother with this room yet until i'm in a safer position in the surf. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Then again, it's not worth losing my one up if I fumble. And I'm probably going to find a shop where I can buy another health flask, so I think I will just heal now to be on the safe side. Oh, nice. 
Nice. S ranked powerful grenade with two scrolls. That swaps this one out. Or do I do a double powerful grenade run now and get rid of the fire? I think that's what I'm going to do. This is a wicked build of got on the go. I'm really stoked. Definitely want to keep those grenade bats away because those guys are brutal. Get out of here, dude. Get out of here. That's not what I want to be doing right now. Now I've got an elite tail in me. One I don't want to deal with <laughs> right now. <laughs> Holy smokes. Oh man, oh man. But he's dead, okay. And I like that even more. to hassle with those guys. Straight up brutality, man. Be a food shop, come on. Chest, okay, well, that's all right. Something to sell anyway. Sometimes it's just best to wait until your grenades are ready. Man, the damage those things do is crazy good. I probably don't even need to be using both on this guy. Or on those guys. One is probably more than enough. Okay, almost takes it out. One or two more brutality scrolls, and I'm pretty sure we'll be one shotting those dudes. going to be a food shop. Nope. Oh, well, that's actually something I can use to heal a little bit and then get rid of it again. Don't mind that. Oh, smash down right into the spikes. You got to be joking me. Okay. Ooh.